Hello everyone. Well, guess where I am? <laughs> Australia. And what am I doing here? Well, I just had to come back and do some stuff. But what's the first thing you do when you get back to Australia from being in Asia? You have bacon and eggs for breakfast. Oh yeah. I should even crack open a beer. Yeah, that'd be real Aussie. So bacon and eggs and um, just going to go and do some stuff and I'm actually heading back there to Singapore on Friday so uh, look out for more videos from there but in the meantime I'm here so look out for probably today and tomorrow videos from here. So uh, what am I going to do now? Well eat some bacon and eggs. Whoa, talk about instant regret after eating that bacon and eggs, oh man, my body must be accustomed to clean living. Because straight away, I had the gut aches. I was like, oh, and then I started to get the sweats. And then I had to run to the toilet. Went straight through me. Oh, gee, it's not good. Oh, I've acclimatized too much to being an Asian. And now that I've come back to being an Australian that's not agreeing with me. Anyway, I had a nice clean clipper, you might have noticed. And I'm just going to go to work now and visit to our rhino, see what he's up to, and then I'm going to make some videos. While I'm here, I might as well. Let's do it. Well, I went in and saw Rhino, and he seems to be going all right. He's got a kid due any moment now, so good on you, Rhino. But uh, it's also the opening ceremony day today for the Commonwealth Games here on the Gold Coast. And it's supposed to be raining all night, so that should be fun. Sitting out there in the rain, watching the Commonwealth Games opening. It's still warm and humid, but it looks like it's uh, lots of storms around. But I'm going to go home and edit some videos and uh, what time is it? Two o'clock. Then that should see me through to beers on the jetty. I'm looking forward to that. Well it's 5.30 p.m. and it's sort of already getting dark. I'm kind of used to it getting dark by about 7.30. Yeah well, how about I tuck on in to one of these. Look at this, I still got heaps of beer in the fridge. Carlsbergs? I don't remember buying those. Yeah, wow, lucky me. Ah, the joys you have when you come home to a fridge full of beers. Anyway, let's go down to the jetty and see if there's going to be a sunset. I doubt it because it's very overcast. Let's go. Well, there's a slight one over there. That looks nice. There's some guy. Oh, there's birds. I haven't heard the sound of birds for ages. Ah, oh, the serenity. Cheers, everyone. Here's a grub hanging from a tree. They do that. I think they wait to fall on something passing by or for a strong gust of wind to blow them up to another branch or... I don't know. But it's something you usually see here in Australia. 
Now, before pen and paper were invented, about 50 years ago, in the old days, Australians used to use beach sand and this seed pod from the, the Poinciana epileke tree. They would smooth out that piece of slate and then write their message. This shore is very different to the hustle and bustle of Singapore. Wow, this is just so relaxing. <laughs> you don't realize how relaxing this is as people just on the beach. You don't really see anyone in Singapore. You couldn't not see someone. But here it's like you've got to look for them. <sighs> the serenity. Well, it started raining, of course, so I decided I'm going to come back, make myself a salad for dinner, and finish this off. <laughs> anyway, thanks for watching it, and I'll try and make another video tomorrow. Okay. If not, I'll see you on Friday, probably.